Hello and welcome back to the next episode. I'm basically continuing where I left off the last time, not making a break in between. So basically where we are going here is now by skipping ahead a bit because we do we need to wait out the aggression of the aliens and see what happens exactly. Probably lose like one or two bases on Mars I would assume like last time. Maybe they go for a station in Earth orbit like the initiative station they just removed. And meanwhile we just build up and wait for our technologies and with the United North America we would be a big step closer to what I really want to have before the alien invasion happens and I still hope that they can unify South America as well before the invasion hits and we can basically bunker us into well as the Americas and blockade the aliens from invading us. We might need to do like one or two more navies and, and therefore armies but if it comes up to be necessary we can just go full priority into army and navy. That's something we can do at that point. Naval scores kicked by the number of navies it has attached to armies multiplied by the nation's military technology score. So yeah, if we get to 6, we would have a score of 36, yeah, exactly. So another navy would give us another 5 to 6 points, so that could go up quite quickly. Assuming that the aliens land with like 6 armies or something, they would have with a military score of 7, they would have yeah, 42 to more if they have i8 armies for example so we still need a little bit but we can also just nuke one or two armies down and then everything is fine just need to make sure that they don't land in america because it would be annoying and then because if they land in america i am definitely going to push them out into the sea and wait for the next invasion which normally happens quite fast afterwards and with that I'm going to just play ahead a bit and just repetitive keep an eye on our unrest and advice on our nations here. Well, 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 we have a problem. But basically we investigated our own agents and our key guy who was doing most of our espionage, command and such miss missions has a loyalty of three. That's something we need to change quickly. I'm going to investigate him again to make sure he's not a traitor already. Violence is but let's see. Why did we lose cohesion? I think I had more already. But who knows. We also invested a little bit more into GDP again because we got some unrest as some storm or something was hitting us and we lost a little bit. But somehow we do have unrest again. Not 100% sure why though. Probably because we went down a little bit in GDP. Something like this. So. Repeating continue. That's at least what I want to do right now. Siberian independence, I don't care. Katanga, no. In fact, we, we're not allowed to pick the tech here because some uh, the. I think Exodus picked it. I'm not sure who won here, but definitely not us. But Arrival Economics is also not too bad. Meanwhile, we have been improving a little bit in our um, Orc department, basically. We've been slowly uh, buying some upgrades for cash, but we are lacking cash quite strongly. But for example, we are now to 25 admin and 23 science on our professor who is advising the US. And that's of course very, very critical right now. Yeah, everything else... Mm, I mean, we could think about taking some... Let's see our relations. Hopefully nobody is at war. Okay, the servants are at war with us, it's fine. Arrest is tolerance or in conflict. That's fine. And if we check the resources. 
370 and 30, that's pretty good. We can do something. 300 here, 50 here, 300 here, 400 here in the academy. Ooh, 420, almost 420 for the protectorate. Yeah, that means we can in fact sneak some stuff in, which we could use for spoils, for example. So of course, very, so we're looking for regions which are resource rich, like Saudi Arabia here. So something might be interesting to Coup Ita this one, maybe Coup Ita Libya, maybe Coup Ita Algeria to just get some spoils going, to have more money and therefore be able to why though? Oh, wrong guy. Uh, where Standing are you? Where to you are the guy. I'm here. Two percent. Yeah, maybe we just start here. Like here. Subverting the government. Oh wait a second. Maybe it's easier it to just perch. Two percent as well. Yeah. Okay. Maybe it's not easier to perch. So we start with Algeria, uh, with Libya here. Ready for my mission. Could also, yeah, we don't do need to. Shishimoto, you're going to get here some better opinions. And Theresa, you are probably going to continue fixing our countries. Yeah, we do need to fix Grand Colombia first. We'll turn down the heat. And yeah, you are Ready. continuing in here. Almost for my. Well, Bolivia is almost done, so one could fix the Restoring US before order. something happens here. Yeah, so basically, it's just progressing forward slowly, really not much going on. Time is just passing by, and we are stabilizing. Okay, we finally got the project of First Nation. Gets claim on Anchorage, White Horse, and Nuke. White Horse would be the capital. Yeah, in fact, I'm going to just throw that in. 500 signs. So let's just do it. I'm going to release this small patch here. And, well, that's not going to change much, but it's still something I want to do. We also. In between, we took over Algeria and Libya, which are going to do mostly spoils, a little bit of unity, just to keep them under our control. And now we are improving relations in Saudi Arabia to... Do it again. Exactly here, to then coup etat Saudi Arabia and take it over. And there goes the project already. And we go back into the Hydra language here. And now we can also prioritize these two again. And that's basically it. There's a lot of a lot of time has passed, but basically nothing is happening right now, and we can't do much. So diamondoids is something we need for ships. Um, I think gas core fission. Yeah, heavy fission pile would be useful for our colonies. We do need to go for mm, the nano factor relatively soon because as soon as we are getting um, shut off from earth we are going to have huge money problems so let's pick, check it out we need construction module and that's it so that should be one of our next projects and with the heavy fission thingy we can in fact probably do something on mars itself already meanwhile we do need mission control but we want to build it space based soon enough that's why we also need the nano factories as well and we also need the settlements which are going to increase our mission control requirements quite a lot but that's something as soon as we have hydro language we slowly go into the text which increase the mission control we can have before the aliens retaliate and go to total war we want to avoid that definitely until the invasion has landed and we can see the near future 
I do think I just want to continue this mission phase and then make a cut here because it's probably a long episode already, but not much has happened here. Hmm. What's happening here? Docked at that station. Whose station is that there? The initiative. And it's gone. Yeah, for some reason the other factions seem to annoy the aliens. Which is fine, as long as they don't retaliate against me. I don't care. The only problem is that the debris count in the upper things is increasing quite fast. Decline here. Select. What do we want to do with you? What, where do you get your admin here from us? Yeah, so I'm going to build him up in admin until I can remove the echo capital here. Which we can then move to a different guy. Also some ad admin here. But there's not much available. Maybe, oh yeah. It's now coming up finally. It's plus 20%. This one is the best you can get Air Force Research Lab. I hoped for it earlier, but I never saw it so far. And now we do have a massive boost on military here. 94%. Directing any investment to the military confers a 4% bonus to all investments for a particular control point, as long as at least one other priority is also receiving any investment. I'm not 100% sure how to understand the second one here. But basically we do have now a 94% bonus on military investments and that's of course massive. We get a lot from our material thingies here. So they give 5% each. 6%. So 30 in total. And with the modifiers from the orcs. That's extremely massive now. And that's really, really good, because now the investments here should go up relatively quickly. And that's going to be great. But here I'm going to make a cut, and I do expect the next missions, or the next episode, to also be relatively, let's say, without action. Because there's really not much going on right now, we can check what's going on here colony ships mostly nothing here as well now where's the mothership though there that is but we still don't see any oh the dreadnought is now available as well mm -mm -mm. i still don't see any invasion ships so that's weird to say the least. Is there anything flying towards Earth here? Destroyer. This one is hunting a station apparently. Another station. Tiangong is going down probably. Yet yeah, nothing going on in regards to invasion yet. Which is confusing. We are on Brutal and last time I played as Academy it hit super early. And we had to use nukes to even have a chance at all because our armies were not ready yet but it's fine with me we have 5.2 we are i think assuming we are going to continue with these like 30 days investment of 0 0.016 it will take us about five six six months to get go up 0 0.1 so we are four years until we have reached like age uh, score of six I don't think we are going to be here on earth at that point but let's see our science is really bad and we do need to investigate how we can work on it it will improve when we unify everything here and afterwards we are going for a space economy so that's basically the plan we finish up our claims here then stabilize everything we got keep 
below 350 control points, probably going below 300 when we unified everything. And then we are just building up space as crazy as we can. That's why we also go into this hydro language tech because we want to get the increased MC so that we can squeeze in some signs, more mining and then shipbuilding when the, let's say, problems start. Therefore, see you next time. Leave a like and subscribe.